How's it hanging fellas? I'm Orosh and this is another episode of Cyberpunk 2077 and in today's episode Oh, I would like to show you something while I'm while I'm here while I'm slowly walking through this hallway Uh, hold on Uh, wait Fuck, alright, I guess I won't show you that Okay, wait, I can show you in the menus Look at the, the cursor Ah, oh, see, it's moving. You see it moving? It's fucking moving. I'm not touching anything. My, both my analog sticks on my controller are broken now. The left one does that. Where the fucking... Anything that requires really precise input will sli move slightly to the, like, uh... Oh, now it's moving fucking faster. Oh, this is ridiculous. Good fucking lord. But then, for example, let's go into shards and... See? It's moving down on its own. This is because the right analog stick is broken. Both analog stick are broken. It's so annoying, look, I'm trying to scroll up and the fucking bullshit scrolling down on its own. Jesus fucking Christ, man. And the other anal and the other controller I have... The, f the right analog is also broken, except in that one it goes forward. So it's really annoying in video games because when I like try to move it does something where it kind of blocks my movement so sometimes when I try to sprint forward for example Yakuza is pretty much unplayable with that controller because you try to go forward and it just keeps stopping here you in place but fucking enough complaining let's finally deliver that stupid shard to um, I guess no one's home to Dexter occupied fucking what do you mean no one's home he waiting. He waiting? Okay, cool. Hey, Dex. It didn't went smooth. N54, even the pirate networks. You blowing up everywhere. And it's cool, right? You know, public any publicity is good publicity. Um, he's dead. He's there. Dead. I guess for Dexter it's like, oh, whatever. Condolences, friend. And the relic. Uh, in my Got fucking right brain. Hmm. I was afraid of that. What? Saburo Arasaka. Dead. You got any notion of the shit you pulled me into? Well, that you wasn't my the fault. Emperor! His Majesty! Didn't do Anyone it. Anyone with so much as a pinky toe dipped in this mess is as good as dead. Well, we gotta get the fuck out, gotta I guess. Leave Night City. You don't say. Ring Evelyn. We close the deal, collect our cut, and drop off the radar. All right, settle down. Gotta be tactical about this. Parker, Eddie's. Then we leave the city limits behind. Actually, I don't remember what is the involvement of uh, Evelyn in this blood all over. thing. Bathroom's there. Another thing. Oh, you know what happened to me while I was playing the game? A new glitch. Every day it's a new glitch in this game. I went into the options and I couldn't get out. And I had to reset Go the game. Up. The options menu in the main menu broke. What, what the fuck is this? It's a cleaning chamber. It looks like a lava lamp. It's me. Get yourself cleaned up. What am I covered in blood? I'm really close to the end of the game. I'm like level 30 something. My reputation's level fucking 50. And it's bit. Fuck the mirror. My reputation's level 50. And it's basically. That's the max level. No, I didn't. <laughs> it didn't broke. And that kind of ruined the, the scene. I just kind of smashed my hand on the fucking mirror. Well, oh well now it's broken. <coughs> I guess it was supposed to be. Hey, what's up? Oh shit! Why would you do that to me? Ouchies! Game risky, V. Remember our first combo? I'll not Seems fucking, like kill, I'll you. fucking kill you. 
No blaze of glory for me. Yeah, so that's the end of the game. We're dead. V's dead now, and... But thankfully the game doesn't... Well, the game just begun, pretty much. <coughs> it's kind of funny. Well, this is the beginning of the game. This is episode, what, 11? And we just begun the game. Because this whole thing so far was a prologue that we've been into because the city was closed. I couldn't move out of the city. I was limited to a small portion of it. That's why I decided to do all the side quests in the small portion while I was there. Oh. That was supposed to be a thing. That was like artistic bullshit. What is this fucking House of the Dead? Oh, I literally like uh, this thing. How now the HUD is different and the colors are like yellow and blue. Hey. You all right? Never been better. Sure don't look it. I'll okay. kill everyone. Hey, hey, we're chill. <gasps> look, guys, it's that famous. It's, it's the guy from Fortnite, John Wick. That's a cool Fortnite easter egg. Of course you're high. I'm fucking higher than you ever will be. Oh shit, everybody's scared of me. Tonight, I'm gonna die. Everybody dies in this game. Unless I'm making the wrong choices. I thought he pulled out a shotgun and he was gonna kill everybody. Well, we don't get to hear the concert, that kinda sucks. First person Guitar Hero. I never played Guitar Hero, but I had a friend who had all these stupid toys. He had like a DJ toy, like a Money drum set, a, like guitars and shit. And I always looked at those stuff when I came over and I was like, what the fuck is this shit? You're wasting your lives following us around like dogs. How much you want what curled up your ass? Okay. I don't know. I'm kind of grumpy. I'm not being very wholesome 100 right now, but... Don't do this. Doesn't matter. You can still change your mind. No. Get over here, man. I love Fuck this you. Band. Not your crowd, not your noise. Do your own thing. Bastard. I'm gonna miss you something awful. See you in the next life, friend. That was super wholesome. You're late. Love it when you're mad. Gets my southern blood pumping. Get in! Or I change my mind! Silverhand. Hey, uh, oops, I guess we got a spoiler who we're playing yeah, as. We're not V on, anymore. Got it? Uh, we're playing as Johnny Silverhand now, you know, the fucking character from Cyberpunk 2020. And this portion of the game, the flashback one, it's taking place in 2023 from what I remember. Which is pretty cool. Unfortunately, you don't get to like see like oh look this is the technology of the past, but it still looks kind of still looks kind of fancy. Like some advanced technology, but it looks kind of shitty. You know what I mean? Like in uh, Fallout, for example, like robots are very advanced, but they look fucking outdated as fuck. Except for sentry bots, I guess they fucking look badass. Jeez, I can't breathe. Are on fire. 2023. Shut down. Make me on the streets of Watson. Sons of bitches. Skull cracking out there. That us? Johnny's idea. Wayland's drawing Aristotle's attention away from the tower. I love the old logo. This is the Cub Scout 
Nowadays they super change it, they just connected the dots to the line. Now it's amazingly improved. Actually, it seems like the opposite would have happened in real life. They would have fucking made it even more simplistic and from a connected tree, they would make that simplistic looking one. Everything has to be simplistic nowadays and every fucking logo looks the same. Why is it that? I like the fucking logos that have like... That's why I like Monster, because they fucking somehow still have this early 2000 edgy looking logo and they never changed it. Enemies got highlighted for me, I'm not sure if that's uh, something that should have happened. Also, I have not been doing a lot of things between episodes, by the way. I've just been doing like, oh, I bought some stuff, I sold some stuff. So, but I think at some point I might actually start um, doing like those uh, not very interesting gigs that I wouldn't really bother to do in normal episodes, because they're not very interesting. There are these odd jobs you can take around the city that are like, oh, go and like, kill someone. And they're very, and they're not at all interesting. They're just kind of like there. You can get some good loot out of them because a lot of them uh, offer you some legendary items. But... But I don't want to do them on episodes. They're fucking boring. Also, you know what, this game... Getting so close to the end of this game, it makes me feel like, I don't know, 40 episodes. I give this series a 40 episodes. Max, like, maybe 51 or something like that. Get the payload on the elevator, arm it, let gravity do its thing. Unless I fuck it up, fuck it up, of course. Yeah, I love this, uh, fucking sequence. Because you get to play as Johnny Silverhand for a little bit. Who's way cooler than me? I got this cool pistol that I think you do get to use. That I think you do get to use in the normal game, but you get it like at the end of the game. I still didn't get it though. I just heard you do. I don't know what's a cheer jog. This is a pseudo. Yeah, this, this gun does like the same damage. 2000 damage per head. I'll be honest with you, some of my guns I had dealt that kind of damage. I had a revolver that dealt like the same damage. But you don't twirl your revolver around. Actually, you do when you hit someone with it. You hit it and then you twirl it. Twirl guns. So I gotta put a bomb in an elevator. Bushido 2, bomb's name is what? Wrap it up! We got a delta! The Demolitron. We're good to blow. Shaka Elite incoming! Demolitron. Shoot the cable! Hold on, I'm like twirling guns. Get the rotor spinning! We're on our way! This gun's so fucking badass, but man. Not done yet. Still need to feed this to their subnet. Oh, there's the new logo. Fucking knew it. This was never Why? about corporate colonialism. This was about your groupie output, wasn't it? No, you wouldn't understand, Rogue. Giving you four fucking. You don't know shit. I'm too complicated for you to understand. <laughs> Simple-minded fool. Love you, Spider. Oh, and the melee hit for some reason spew fire. Which I don't know if it's the gun doing that or is it Johnny's fucking hand. He can just spit fire like that out of his hand. That's pretty badass. I kind of wish you could change whenever you want to that other HUD. I would do that like every once in a while and fucking change my HUD. Cool if you could change the color of your HUD in this game. Like in uh, Fallout 4. 
Even though I never changed the color of my Fallout 4 HUD, it was always Sweet orange. Foreign, it was right? always like a New Vegas. Just wonder if we know anyone who can switch the subnet protocol. That's the Hilarious. thing, New Vegas came out, it was fucking broken and unplayable. And everybody loves that game. What's, what's the fucking Thanks. deal with this game? No, Why is it just, just fucking... I'm playing it on a PS4. I'm having no fucking major issues. Did you see a single glitch so far? No, I fucking haven't seen anything. The game didn't broke a single time for this let's play. Only thing I seen is like, oh, I don't know, some model fucking clipping there and fucking doing some weird shit. Night City's mayor, Mbole Ebunike, has issued I think I really, I'm the same Johnny that you do meet in the game. Because the, the funny thing about Johnny Silverhand is that going now to our reporter on the in the Fallout, uh, not Fallout, he can some light on Cyberpunk 2020, he looks set. super different than this Johnny. He looks way fucking more lame. Get to the roof. Oh no. I got some cool leather pants though. That's Adam Smasher. That's Adam Smasher. Yeah. Said that already. Johnny, run! He's like super insane. And also I guess I did manage to run because inexplicably I'm all of a sudden fucking here. Murphy! I think it doesn't tell you how I got here. Run, Johnny. Like the wind. Weird. I'll run like the wind. I was seeing the helicopter like popped on into place. That was the first glitch I seen. And that wasn't even a glitch, I was just approaching a sequence too fast. And the helicopter didn't too pop like it should have. Smasher. Told you, Johnny boy. Told you I'd end you someday. So Adam Smasher fucking murdered me. And that's it, I'm fucking dead. Keanu Reeves is dead. What movies do you guys like Keanu Reeves in? Matrix? Fucking John Wick? Bill and Ted? Uh, Dracula? Probably plenty more, but I don't fucking know him. <clears throat> Speaking of things you can watch, have you guys seen the finale of Mandalorian Season 2? Well, what do I think about it? Well, CG look looks fucking stupid. Not much I can tell you. He looks like something out of Battlefront. You know what, I think his model in Battlefront look better because it's, at least it's a video game. But in that show, it's like everybody's real and then, then the CGI look. And everybody said, can't you fucking get an actor that looks like fucking Luke? Look, if you get in Solo, you got a guy who looks nothing like Harrison Ford, but you said this is Han Solo, and I'm like, all right, this is Han Solo. Let us try once more. Despite him looking different, this is still the same character. Who are they? Oh wait, where am I? Oh, it's me again. Gonna give a good cop over there a chance to say something? Come on. <gasps> it was Johnny who said it. But the font was mine. Wait, what? Which terrorist organization do you belong to? This is How Johnny. You acquire fissile material? But the font is mine. Wait, am I turning into Johnny now? Am I Keanu Reeves? Hey, Gramps. I know you. Oh, oh look, I love the nuclear explosion in the background. Giant fucking mushroom cloud in the fucking distance. By the way, in the story of Cyberpunk, which I'm not very knowledgeable about, but uh, I know oh, that between damn. 2020 and Done 2077, and there's been like a huge fucking war. My husband died in that tower. Good. But there are fates worse than death. Yeah, so they're gonna like. I don't really get why the fuck they did that. She has she has cool glasses. Want him to die. Naze, kono yona koto. So he. Why did you do this? He'll be put into the chip that I have inside my head. Madness, you freak. 
とは嘘をつき自分自身も欺く And this guy's supposed to be like 100 years old or something. Shaw, you bendaga, Kaderava Kishte Uso Tskane. She shall no Kotobania, Sumash Samar. Oh, yeah, Hajimiro. I'm gonna die now. I'm gonna get electrocuted. Soul killer. Ah. So I guess it's not Adam Smasher who killed me, but Arasaka. I didn't sound very in pain. I sounded more like I was annoyed. It sounded more like it stinged me in the head, and I was like, "Ouch! What? The, ow! What the fuck, man?" Well, I'm in the Matrix now. Fuck. Whoa. Hey, yeah, what's that? <laughs> Skianu. It's that place we just been to. <clears throat> yeah, so I'll recap this fucking episode. They storm uh, this evil guy, who I still don't exactly get what his deal is. A uh, ship that looks like a butt block, right? And yeah, they storm it. Pretty cool. Boba Fett doesn't do much. To help, I mean, he just pilots the ship. He's like fucking dad who drives everybody around. It's probably like the oldest character out of all everybody. And there. you, who are you? Who are you, Keanu? I don't know. I've been shot in the face though. And and then like. You know, like the moments where they go through this fucking ship and they just kill everybody is like cool. But my favorite is when like uh, Mando, Din Jaren, I think his name. I finally remembered his name. It's Din Jaren. Like he goes through the ship, and he like murders everyone. No, he like when he fucking kills people, it's more like f cool, because everyone else just kind of shoots them. But like Mando fucking strangles a guy with a spear and breaks his neck. <laughs> He fights a, sto a dark trooper, which is like really tough. I don't know, man. In Dark Forces, those guys died pretty quickly. Dark Forces is the best game ever. It's not, but it's a good one. At least they let me keep the suit. So basically, this the plot of this game is Fallout New Vegas. You get shot in the head and then you crawl out of your grave. It's exactly the same. This game is just as broken as New Vegas is as well. Except, I guess I didn't get dug up by an annoying cowboy robot. I got fucked. I dig up myself. And there was a lot of prologue to why I got shot in the face in the first place. I kind of fucking like that in uh, New Vegas to find out what the fuck I've been doing before I got shot. Because the Lonesome Road, the ELC doesn't really explain it very well. It just says something like, oh, you're evil, you were evil. You were a fucking asshole. The whole apocalypse is your fucking fault. And it's like, shut the fuck up, Ulysses. You're such an annoying piece of shit. I fucking killed Ulysses when I fucking played New Lonesome Road. So fucking annoying. And then I bombed everybody by accident, I didn't mean to. But I had a status of ruthless thug everywhere, which is pretty cool. Hey, it's Takamura. Oh, and it's Dex. Ugh, heavier than he looks. Maybe you're weaker than now, you look. Listen, dog. I have done exactly what you asked. So let's you and me figure this <laughs> Everybody. Everybody got shot. With your shirt. Arasaka-sama, Otoo-sama no sasugai han o tsukemashita. Well, this is way cooler than you, I guess. See, guys, the rig... The deal was rigged from the start. Fuck! Quiet! Ouchie. The fuck? Nobody's my friend. Everybody just slaps me around, fucking throws me around like an asshole. Oh, nice car. Are we going for a fun drive? I hope so. 
Cause I'm sick of not having fun and being thrown sorry, around. Oh, I'm sorry. I just dug myself out of trash. <laughs> You're fucking insulting me now. <coughs> so they stormed the ship, and um, I found it funny how like they storm ship first, and then Mando like comes later, and he's fucking. It's it seemed like he fucking forgot to come out of the ship. Yeah, and and what happened later? Fuck. Well, they fight the robots. They get to Moff Gideon. That was his name. Moff Gideon, the bad guy. Use it. And and then Mando gets a dark saber, which is pretty badass because it was owned by Darth Maul at one point. Which is pretty awesome. It's his fucking favorite Star Wars character. Oops. I pull bike, dude. Can I take it? Whoa. Oh, invisible gun. You got it. There it is. Are you bothered by that kind of glitch? I'm not fucking bothered by that kind of shit. Oh, well, gun didn't load it, dude. Too big fucking deal. You know what, at least gunplay in this game is good, because if I had to fucking play New Vegas right now, I would like to play New Vegas on my channel at some point, but... The, the thing I hate about New Vegas is uh, the gunplay. It's not fucking fun in this line, it's fucking... bit. And what is this car we're driving? So you're immortal in this section of the game, so you don't even need to fucking bother about dodging. Whoa, that was weird. What kind of booster? What are you talking about? Oh shit. I'm trying to shoot. giant blades hidden in your forearms. Yeah, you do, and you, I do have them on my other safe file. But maybe if I spec them to blade weapons, I'd be like super awesome with them, but I just kind of use them sometimes and I just slash at everyone. Don't you dare faint again. Oh, okay then, Keep I will not. Finish him off. We both could use medical attention. Do you know a Ripadoc whom you can trust? Vic? I know. Someone. You don't know anyone? We must get the Ripadoc. Quickly. So we're both kind of fucked up. Victor. Will. Fix us up. We have to get there somehow. Call someone. Anyone. That was a cool vehicle. I, I never. I don't fucking right, remember. Right. I don't remember seeing a car like this in the game. My scanner indicates you are outside the is it some kind of cut vehicle from the game, or is it just I never paid attention? Pick me up. Need to get to Misty's Esoterica. In front of Vix. Of course, a vehicle is en route. It should Della arrive May. in less than 20 minutes. What are you doing? By the way, we're playing with the 1.5 update. Hey! Which I don't fucking know what it really grants you. What, what did it fix? If anything. Some glitches, I guess. This sequence still has some weird graphical thing, like the guy who fell off the bike and he kind of floated for a moment. The fact that the gun didn't show it into my hands. The personal link is damaged. 
That's the one of the bullshit. To insert the jack below the ear. Also, why do people Though compare this game to GTA 5? It's not a fucking RPG. GTA 5 is what that is. Well, if he's I saving me now. My mistake, he will die. Indeed, as he will if you do nothing. I think I have the socket. Now Takamura help me. His name is Takamura. And he's a cool dude, I'm friends with him. Or at least I will, maybe, if I'm not gonna be a dick to him. Anyway, what was I saying? Oh yeah, Mandalorian. <coughs> Man, my fuck the throat. What about Mandalorian? What did I finish talking about? So he gets the dark saber, and then Luke shows up on the ship because you know two episodes ago, my Baby Yoda was fucking busy uh, calling for a Jedi to show up. But Luke, why Luke? Why Luke Skywalker? I cannot hold it. Cause I don't know if you guys watch the fucking sequels, but episode eight, I think it was eight or nine. No, it was eight. Explained that you know Luke at some point started a new school of Jedi's, and he fucked it up. Why? Because he saw the darkness within Kylo Ren, you know Han Solo's son, and he tried to kill him for a moment. But then he was like, "No, I shouldn't kill him." But Kylo still fucking killed everybody because he got fucking spooked. But Luke, so Luke fucking majorly fucked it up. Dumbass, fucking idiot, by trying to kill little children because they might have been fucking edgy. He wanted to kill every edge lord, and he ended up fucking everything up. So where was Baby Yoda that during that time? Baby Yoda wasn't present when <coughs> Luke was dying in Episode Eight. It's, didn't see him anywhere in the sequel. So I'm assuming Baby Yoda was fucking slaughtered by Kylo Ren in the Jedi Temple, and I don't really care about that because I don't really like Baby Yoda because he's annoying. Ooh, my feet and. But the most important part of the ending, two things that I find the most important is that Mando, Din Djarin, he's the fucking leader of the Mandalorians now because he's the one who rightfully um, wields the dark saber because he won it How in battle, he? which is the only way you can acquire it legitimately. Slower on the men than you, but looking better every day. Ah, oh, thanks. I'm so worse than everyone. What the fuck is his deal? First he slaps me and tells me to shut the fuck up. He killed Dex. And now, now he cares for me. Oh look, he probably writes me like a letter, like, oh, get well soon. Wrote on my shoulder, thank you. Thanks, brah. It's like, fucking get better, homie. Hell yeah, I'll get better. V, you in there? Ah, no. My head. Nobody's home. How you feeling? Fuck. Fuck. Seeing fucking Finny do that. Alright. Here's a ring. Free fucks, that means I'm doing amazing. These hallucinations. Describe them to me. Blinding lights. I see a it's loud. doctor standing in front of me. I, almost can't I see Spunky Monkey. I'm so damn full of hatred. Then I let it all out into a mic, and I realized it didn't help. I don't feel any better. Wow, me, you're fucked up. I promise not to laugh. I plan a bomb in Arasaka Tower. Nothing there to laugh about. They killed, they killed me. me, Vic. Never been so afraid. It was too real, even for a lucid dream. You weren't dreaming, V. Those were memories. Memories of Keanu Reeves. On that shard. Dreams you had were from his past. Hang on. I mean to say there's an actual terrorist in my head. Right now. Yeah. That's right. 
Johnny Silverhand. At his crowning moment about 50 years ago. There's a character in this game called Morgan Blackhand, and it's like, where the fuck is he? His doing. Supposedly he was like the partner of Johnny Silverhand in the terrorist thing. But you don't anyway, see him anywhere in the game. Adam Smasher right is in it, Rogue is in it. But Morgan Blackhand, are they saving him for the sequel? Is Morgan Freeman gonna fucking show up to play Morgan Blackhand? Well... Talk to me. Think you can top the terrorist in my brain? Yeah. The biochip. It's basically a bomb. Fuse lit already. You don't have much time left. Much... life. A few weeks tops. Hey, Silver fuck you, I have at least 30 more episodes. Your consciousness, gradually taking over your body and that's... Until, well, that's free. Uh, one day no, wait. Be that's about over three weeks. Hey, don't be sad. V, it's when I'm gone, I want everybody to smile this. and be happy. You're, you're full of shit. Don't believe an ounce of the horse shit coming from your mouth. Know why? Because it doesn't make any goddamn sense. Whatever's happening to me, there's a logical explanation. Gotta be. There's You're always the a logical the explanation. Thing. Why can't you help me? Yes, yeah, so I'm assuming Mandalorian Season 3 is gonna focus on... Short. It's not gonna be bullshit babysitting story. It's gonna be about Mando fucking, I don't know, fighting for the freedom of Mandalore. Don't admit a thing, not one deep. Okay. Nah, shit, I should have chose the other short story. A construct, a psyche on the chip, that of Johnny Silverhand. Okay, and now he's Ejected in my brain, killing me. Nothing happened, right? Until you died. Bullet in the head from Dexter to Sean. But how do you come back from something like that? And yet, how do you Calibre, also not you have a not giant nice bullet wound in your face? Mr. Deshaun. The nanites off the chip started fixing the damage. Then they took your hand and coaxed you off the path toward the light. So I'm a Frankenstein. You're Dr. Victor and I'm your monster. Perfect. Your body's only a body. You can modify it, replace it with chrome, hell. Why is that why Victor's name's Victor? The f I don't know what the Your fuck was the up. doctor's name. I don't fucking. No, I never read Frankenstein. Like another story. I never fucking watched it. From the biochip's perspective, I never too. I never too been too much into to the hammer down. monsters. Wow. The Dracula, fucking to hold the swamp monster, and so this fucking invisible man. Wants to wipe me and take my place, they will. take my body. It's not willful. Wolfman. What's the difference between Beowulf and Wolfman? And neither of you can stop it. The both werewolves. Nick, eh. you've always come through for me. If there's nothing you can do to help me, then. Well, what the hell do I do? Tell me, please. I got an imaginary Nick. friend in my face. I wish I knew. Kid. In my head, I should start a fight club. Misty. Except this time it's Keanu and not fucking Brad Pitt. I don't like Fight Club, by the way. I need to stress this enough. You're asking too much from an I don't like Fight like Club. Vic. Come on, V. Your boyfriend's Let's dead. Get you home. Your boyfriend's fucking dead. You can't romance Misty, by the way. I tried. A lot of people think she's ugly, man. Man, you, you guys are fucking ugly. Shut the fuck up. Insulting my waifu and shit. Now pan him. Now this is probably what they spend most of their fucking time developing the game. What's making her ass look fucking fine? And my other character, I. Right? Like 75% of the and story, I, I think. Gonna die. With him in my sleep. What? Who, sleep Jackie or, or Johnny? Death. The inevitable. Because now Johnny's gonna be my new best friend since, now. well, Jackie's dead. I mean, I could be dead already, right? 
You know, as much as I felt like, oh, this is bullshit, Jackie's probably alive. <coughs> maybe he's gonna come back to life like that's me. Some meds for you. Since he had the chip Omega in his blockers. head for a while, maybe Thinking some of it like stayed. They'll keep things from progressing too quickly. The blue pill and the red pill. Also, you should keep purpose. that guest of yours calm and quiet. Pseudo endotrizines from me. Effect will be opposite. It'll speed things up. Free the demon, so to speak. Take the red pill. Take the red pill. Take it, take it, take it, take it. I gotta lie down. I really do. Here. Got one more thing for you. I gotta lie down awkwardly. The wrong Good way. Pulled this out of your skull. On my stupid A lucky bed. charm? Why the fuck would you give me that? Promise you'll try to get some sleep. You made a lucky charm up, up from like the bullet I got shot lovely, with. Lovely, Misty. Thanks. Thanks. Good night, V. Sweet, peaceful dreams. You know what V stands for? You won't believe it. You know what it stands for? This actual. This is my actual name in this game. Vincent. They say it once in the game and they just completely fucking not talk about it anymore. After that. Just like, oh, it's Vincent. And then V goes like, nobody calls me that. Please don't use my full name. It's like, I thought maybe, like, oh, maybe he assumed V stands for Vincent. Like, he took a guess. But no, V doesn't say, like, no, it's just V. It's not Vincent, it's V. No, he says, like, don't call me by my full name. Gotta get out of here, understand? Unless I don't remember that scene, right? And hey, Keanu, shut up. In my way. You included. Get off my bed, you freak. I'm sleeping. You're having, you're having fun? Man, you're such a dick. We don't smoke in this house. You didn't need a smoke. You're a fucking hologram. You're a fucking ghost. Why do I have a shining? It's not the shining. Where'd you even come from? How are we even talking? How the fuck should I know? Yeah, the good fuck point. Kind of joy toy are you supposed to be? Joy fucking toy. ghost off! Ghost off? Oh man, this is like Blade Runner, except instead of having a holographic cute girlfriend, I have a fucking annoying Keanu Reeves in my head. Fuck off. Ow. Who you work for? Start talking! Fuck. I work for you, I guess. His silver hand even looks outdated for what the world we live in. His fingers are like weird. I do like his uh, chip. bullet vest. The Rip fact the thing out myself. No that way. he wears it and he looks cool. It's pretty cool. He's pretty cool. Ugh. Keanu in my head. Sounds cool, but it's actually not. I'll take control. I'll find a way. Don't do it. Ah, oh, my window. You hear me? It's all dirty now. I even didn't broke it. Last thing I need now is fucking window repairs. Keanu is such a dick. See you never, asshole. Now like that. Stick some on my meds. Pull the trigger. Slap me. I can feel it. Our minds touch on you. Oh, that's touching. Like mold on fruit creeping into you. Nothing I can do about it. Oh, and you, you know what's the, mo the best part of the finale? Could. It's just a copy of the end. Uh, the after credits scene. Apparently, this whole fucking time. Oh, I didn't set it. Oops. Oh, fuck me. This whole fucking time, when Jabba the Hutt, right, was gone, was dead, killed by Leia in Episode Five. 
five? Yeah, five. Um, <clears throat> was it five or was it fucking six? I don't remember. Gotta rewatch the fucking old, old, old original trilogy. Oh man. And the uncensored version, you also sit in your underwear here. I do that sometimes. No, I did that. Uh, and my shower is like a walk-in shower, I just realized that. And I'm under shower. Man, this sucks. How do I look? Well, I'm still Jimmy Bob. Still look the same. Alright, stop looking at your beautiful face. Speed, uh, stock up on ammo, open your inventory. Check your email, what do I gotta fucking do, house chores? Shut the fuck up. And apparently this whole time, ever since episode, well that episode where Jabba died, right? His empire was owned by that weird looking asshole who wears a tentacle like a scarf. Which is pretty funny, in my opinion. No, rent buzz do, really? Oh, cool, thanks. For, thanks for keeping in touch. And now... We finally got to fucking see him again. Not that I cared, but he got fucking shot in the face by Boba Fett. And that I did care to see. Him just fucking killing people all willy-nilly. Like a cool guy would. Oh yeah, what, what the fuck are my guns? He fucking took everything out of my inventory. I got this cool gun. I found a gun like this on my other character with like 800 damage on it. Which is pretty fucking insane. If you ask me. Uh, hold on. First of all. This, this pistol's fine. I could actually keep it. Alright, um. Oh, I think I was using Chaos. 102. 102, you say, huh? Chaos is 102. How about this gun? Oh. 56. No, no, no. Fucking goddammit. And the shotgun, which I think I was using this one. Oh, look, a new shotgun. Is it significantly better than mine? It is not. It is. Not even better, it's the same fucking damage. This is worse than mine, why is it shown us better? It's the exact same damage. Is it, am I fucking blind? No, it is the same fucking damage. Yeah, I'm not gonna run around fucking naked. Thankfully, the censorship does work. So I'm not, I'm not gonna have to blur out anything. The fuck was I wearing while I was playing the game? Well, this has better stats. Who cares that I'm gonna run around dressed like an Arasaka soldier? What matters is that I'm gonna look cool. Gonna look cool doing it. And I know it is not the best course of action to put style over everything else, but this is kinda how I fucking roll. Style over substance is basically what I fucking live like. Purple pants? I'm not gonna wear purple pants. Fucking insane. Insane in the membrane? These are cool. I wish they just showed me like which shoes are the best. Instead I gotta scroll through them. I got a cool mask or something. <clears throat> I got cool sunglasses. Yeah, I look fucking dumb. Take them off because fucking they look stupid. Do I have scopes? I do. I'm gonna put uh, this one. Scopes are <clears throat> useful. <clears throat> God damn, sorry about that. I'm just fucking dying over here. I have fucking cyberkilosis. Like V over here. Cyberculosis. I'm surprised nobody fucking used that as an actual term. 
The fuck am I investing in? I think reflexes, right? I think reflexes, indeed. And then I was investing in shotguns. Well, here we are. <coughs> stock up on ammo. Where am I supposed to stock up on ammo? I don't have a fucking ammo dispenser anywhere. But you know what I'll think? What I think I'll do? I think I'll fucking end the episode here. I love this, um, like it's uh, descends into this fucking couch area. It's pretty, pretty nice. It's a nice day outside, and I guess I'm gonna fucking go and explore and live my life to the fullest now that I fucking know it's about to end. You know, I'm gonna look at everything positively, that's how you fucking get through every day. So I do it, at least. Yeah, so, <clears throat> Boba Fett shoots the guy, and then he takes over Jabba's business. So now, Boba Fett rules Jabba's empire. And then the fucking episode ends by saying Book of Boba Fett. So season 3 is either going to be about uh, Mando taking Mandalore or it's gonna be about Boba Fett ruling Jabba's empire. Or maybe perhaps it's gonna somehow intertwine these two stories into one. Either way I'm gonna finish the episode here. See you fellas in the next episode. Bye.